The World Ocean School is a nonprofit that owns and operates Schooner Roseway, the ship that we're on, uh, and then that organization partners with Boston Public Schools to bring this programming to students. We break the student groups up into usually three or four groups and rotate them through uh, stations like navigation, which I think they're doing back here, and kind of tying it into what they see around them. We're also doing a harbor ecology lesson, uh, talking a lot about pollution and runoff. It's like when you're in a classroom, when you're talking about this stuff, you could just imagine it, but when you're standing right in the middle of it, it's like you really could feel like what happens around you. Allowing them to come on a boat and be surrounded, not just by the city, but by people that are teaching them things that they would never really learn otherwise. I learned that <coughs> plankton um, do like to eat each other. <laughs> I learned that the there's a port side of the boat and there's a star. I think it, I call it the starburst because it sounds like starburst, but I think it's starbert and it's um, on the right side. We learn about all the oceans around us. We learned about pools. We learned about cleaning pools and oceans. The map, um, how, how, how pollution starts, and all the simple machines on the boat. The other piece of this programming that I think is really cool, and it's particular to Roseway, is her history in the harbor. She is considered a National Historic Landmark, and she was the last sailing pilot vessel in the Boston Harbor. The Community Preservation Act was absolutely essential for us to have the means to get that work done. Um, um, and Roseway's in the best condition she's been in. So it's really cool for us as an organization to be able to not only provide really cool educational experiences for students in Boston, um, but also share a piece of Boston history with them. One of the most impactful things I had from a student was on one of our evaluations. And one of the students in his evaluation at the end wrote down, on the Roseway, I'm not dumb. And to see that we're having that kind of an impact that students that in a traditional classroom aren't able to learn and absorb the information, on board the ship where they're actually seeing and touching, we're doing math problems where they pull on a line and something's really heavy and then we use multiplication with a pulley system and suddenly they can lift something that weighs much more than they can. And so they're using math and experiencing it. It's not just numbers on a sheet of paper, they're actually living their education.